time we took some video, we were down at the CNC mill. The guy was making these hatch mold pieces. One's an inside and one's an outside. So in the meantime, the carpentry shop went ahead and built some boxes and we mica'd them. And then we went ahead and routed out a little inset. Fits these just right. So once we get these all finished up and polished and everybody's ready, we'll glue them together. And then we use what's called a wax fillet. And the wax fillet makes a perfect radius for the mold. And you use this hot, hot ball. You torch that thing up red hot and you get it on here and slowly go around and it'll give you a perfect radius all the way around. It's a lot easier than having to use filler and putties and sanding and primers and such. And it gives you a pretty good result. So what we have here are the masters for the leaning post storage. This is a cooler, it's 150 quarts. It's got a nice ledge built around three sides so we can put all our sandwiches and dry goods up on a shelf and keep them in the cooler along with the ice and the drinks without things getting mushy, getting wet. And this is a live well that'll sit next to it in a leaning post. It's 55 gallons. It's got nice big radiuses on it. In the floor next to the leaning post will be another well, which is the same size but cut down a couple inches. It'll be 45 gallons. And that'll be a nice floor well to dump your net in, sort your bait, or segregate your bait from the large upper well to the lower well. So next time we meet as well, these will be further along and you'll get a better idea of what they offer.